Here's Greer. Let's it go off his back foot. Incomplete. Nice coverage by Chris Boyd, intended for David Sills. He's 7 of 11 this year, including a long of 49 yards against Kansas. And good. Evan Staley. On the outside is where it affects him. Second down and 10. Ellinger decides to run it. And Ellinger will pick up the first down and more. Five of the 25. Here comes the pressure. Ellinger in trouble. Flings it. And what a catch by Lowe Jordan. A 24-yard gain. And I'd say he has a great catch radius. Unbelievable catch. And Ellinger's got no shot in the pocket. He's retreating and just throws it up. You can do that when you've got a guy on the outside that is 6'5", 225. And he goes up and wrestles it away. Wow. Little Jordan Humphrey. Ellinger runs it himself. Touchdown, Broncos. He's a fullback that can throw it. Goes in motion. Greer, quick release. Sideline, once again, it's Sims. And Sims will drag defenders. Sims with 37 catches this season. Greer delivers. Caught. Sims running. Touchdown, near 60 yards. And you said it. Well, here's the route, okay? He's gonna come right there, and right there he slips past the safety, and that's the blown coverage. Caden Stearns has gotta know he doesn't have help over the top. P.J. Locke tries to get over there. West Virginia has to punt away, kick away from the 10-yard line. And with Jordan Humphrey with a head start. Midfield, 40, and he gets deep inside West Virginia territory. Ellinger to the sideline. Ellinger to Duvernay, and Duvernay picks up a first down. Ellinger to throw it again over the middle. Caught! One jump, touchdown! 21 yards! Here comes a blitz. They pick it up. Rear to Sells! Touchdown, Mountaineers! What a throw! And what a catch! David Sills with his second touchdown of the first half. And West Virginia goes up 16-14. He certainly has now. On first down, Ellinger running the football, cuts it inside, gets to the 30, still on the move. Sam Ellinger gets to the 40. Ellinger to throw it. No, he decides to run and picks up the first down. Ellinger. Delivers. Caught Duverday. Ran a great route. Devin Duverday on third and 20. Picked up about 17. Ellinger. Fires. Ellinger. And it's caught by Colin Johnson. Sam Ellinger hands it off. Watson. Pennestine. First down. Watson still on the move. Watson gets inside the five. They'll run it again with Watson. Touchdown, UT. And just like that, the Longhorns march it right back down the field to take a 20 to 17 lead. Oklahoma State on the other side against Kobe Boyce. Greer surveys the defense, finds a soft spot for Tevin Bush. Petaway. Slashing Petaway with a burst. Petaway. Look at him go. And touchdown, Mountaineers. 55 yards for the junior from Detroit. You're going to get a great block right here by the center and the right guard. They're going to open up the hole, and then watch his pet away. He's going to get this seam, and then he's going to cut back to the left side, and Caden Stearns, the safety number seven, overruns the play, takes a bad angle, and pet away winds up in the end zone. Sixth lead change in this game, and we're in the first half. Down at four after the six-yard gain, Ellinger. Again with a completion this time, it's Duvernay. Ellinger play fake, 
Looks back side, now front side. Caught again. Little Jordan. Sam Ellinger. And he's got it. Receiver Watson. First down. And more. Watson touchdown. Texas. 32 yards. Here's Greer. Underneath. As a receiver in first down, Giovanni Haskins, the tight end. If he overcorrects, most likely he'll hook it. From 44 yards away. Staley. Perfect. 44 yard field goal for Evan Staley. Ellinger. Blakefield. Ellinger goes through his progression. Don't look. No! Texas catches a break. That ball poked away from behind. And I believe it may have been Keith Washington with the punt. Ellinger runs it, looking for the first, and he has it. His helmet comes off. After reviewing the play, the runner's helmet came off prior to making the line of the game. The ball is dead immediately at that point. Therefore, it will be first down West Virginia. Wow, big stand for the Mountaineers. And they can't believe it in Austin. If Shaka Smart needs a rebounder, number <laughs> to help him out. Ellinger! Duvernay, close to a touchdown. That ball marked inside the one. Ellinger, trying to run it. And West Virginia this time strings that play out nicely. And they'll lose about three to four yards on the play. Kenny Robinson. Ellinger reverses his field. Ellinger looking. Incomplete. Tim Beck was in the back of the end zone. Cameron Dicker into attempted 22 yarder. Five to go in the third. Texas gets it to the 46. Greer comes one, and it's caught. Marcus Sims, what a run after the catch, breaking tackle after tackle, and he's finally Greer with the handoff. No, they didn't get it. What a stand by Texas at the bottom of the pile. P.J. Locke, also Gary Johnson. And that's the end of the third quarter. Gets it off. Ellinger, under pressure, bounces out of the pocket. Becomes a runner. Ellinger, look at him. Smash my first down. UT. They say he eats nails for breakfast. He may be short by about a yard. Kenny Robinson stops him. Boy, second time today that on a big third and long, they're able to get all the way down there close. Boy, he's extending. He needs to get that ball all the way to the 20-yard line. It looked like he was just a touch short. Yeah, even when his elbow comes down and that knee comes down even before it, he's a little short of the 20. And with the wind here, I think this is the right call to go ahead and get Cameron Dicker on the field. Cameron Dicker, 10 of 15 on the season, along of 47 against Baylor from 38 yards away. And it's good. Dicker. The kicker. Texas defense is starting to get stingy. Greer over the middle. And it's caught for first down by Trevon Wesco. The second quarter. He's got two touchdowns in this game. McCoy out the back via first down. Mountaineers. Greer. Winds up for the home run. It's a terrific defense for UT. At the Texas 43. McCoy cuts it in. First down. Kennedy McCoy. Pedaway. Pedaway. Pedaway again. 13 yard touchdown for the Mountaineers. And with 540 remaining in the fourth quarter. West Virginia with a chance to level this game at 34. Ellinger, play 
fake. Over the middle. Caught this time by Ben. They missed that play twice for touchdowns. Elegant play fake. Sideline. Ben. And first down, Texas. Just a 10 to the 48. Texas going to the running game. No. Elegant sprint side. Down the field. Open. Double move on the outside. Duvernay sells it perfectly right there to the out. And then he runs right by Josh Norwood, number four. And Ellinger hits it for the touchdown. Two timeouts left. Second and two. Greer surveys. Greer bounces it around. Dumps it off. And he has Gary Jennings who gets out bounds. Bush, the motion man. Greer looking. Greer. And he has a first down to David Sills. They finally find Sills. I tell you, that's the matchup here. Now we're getting close to it. Snaps it anyway. Green lobs it in the air. Oh! What a catch, Gary Jennings. Touchdown, West Virginia. Wow. What a throw by Will Greer. With 16 seconds left. Oh my goodness. Is his foot down? Absolutely. Oh my goodness. I have not seen a throw like that in that situation. That was an absolute dime. And you know one thing. Dana Holgerson Time is out. going for two. Now they've switched it. Chris Boyd, who is the senior corner, now he's going to be matched up one-on-one. -on -one. Great adjustment by Texas. They're going to be at the top of your screen. That's Sills and Boyd right here at the top. They've also got a help man to take away the slant. This ball's going to go down to the right side. Greer in the gun. Greer, quarterback run. Greer! He got it! Touchdown! Two-point conversion for West Virginia. the horns down we saw Sills draw a flag after a touchdown earlier in the game this is going to be an unsportsmanlike after the two-point conversion is good the result of the play is the extra point try is good after the play unsportsmanlike conduct number seven on the offense 15-yard penalty will be administered on the kickoff that's number seven's first unsportsmanlike of the game will greer with the two-point conversion, West Virginia up by a point, but Texas still has life. Ellinger to the sideline. Ellinger finds her. They throw it across the field, and it's broken up. Batted around, and West Virginia finally claims a football and victory. Will Greer leads the Mountaineers on a dramatic drive. And two-point conversion. And the Mountaineers defeat the Longhorns 42-41 to to improve to 7-1 on the season. Which I'd say that was fun and that was confident. The decision to go for two there. Take me through your mindset and the confidence you had in that move. Uh, that was an easy decision when you got number seven at quarterback and 13 out there at wideout. You know, when they scored, I was like, good, they scored quick. Went to the offense and said, let's go score and then do what we do on a two-point play. Uh, we've been saving that one. We got a lot of confidence in it. So we, the decision was already made before we took the field. You've had success in this house before. And speaking of your quarterback, you said he's a professional playing the college game. What can you tell me about his ability to lead this team when it matters most? Well, I mean, he, I mean, Will, you're right. He's a pro. Will's a What's going on? Now watch that.
context, I, uh, seven's a pro. He happens to be playing the college game. He never got rattled. He kept playing. I was really proud of how he handled the situation. Thank you. Congrats, Coach. 1,100 yards of offense, 10 touchdowns, no turnovers. Greer, 28 of 42, 346, three touchdowns, and a two-point conversion that will be remembered in Morgantown forever.